G'day fellow Black Pillars and Inkwells, it's Master Yoda here and I hope you guys are all doing well. The title of today's uh, video is Why You Should Not Ask Women Out and I must thank uh, YouTube user A Desolate Soul for this suggestion. So yeah, look, I'll, I'll qualify my reasons why why you shouldn't ask women out. Of course, unless of course they give you clear choosing signals and that's a different story for a woman's making it known to you that she's interested in you. Um, well then, yeah, maybe you could probably, probably could approach her there. But in terms of cold approaching, like the uh, the PUA scammers uh, like to teach, no, probably not a good idea for a number of reasons. Um, you know, it's, it's almost certain. You know, if 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 you do cold approach them, you're going to be rejected. Um, especially the, 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 the ridiculous day game of these PUA's push. I mean, what 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 are these guys thinking? I mean. You know, you're colding approach to you're cold approaching a woman without her giving you the green light to do so. What do you think is going to happen? She's going to get creeped out. She she's she's going to say, you know, who's this random creep approaching me? It's it's a massive social faux pas, guys. It really is. Um, and also too, uh, you know, you 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 risk getting me tooed. Uh, as many of you probably will. I know you, you a lot of you guys come from all different countries. In, around the world, particularly the Western world, but here in Australia, I know they've uh, really beefed up uh, uh, sexual harassment laws. So you need to be very careful, guys. Like you know, you could be in a workplace, and even if you say something as harmless to a woman, oh, you know, I like your top or something, you know, she could run off to HR and you know potentially stuff up your career. So you, you've got to be extremely careful, guys. I mean, really careful. Um, yeah, so you know. Cold approaching or asking women out without them giving you clear choosing signals is yeah not not a good idea, guys. It really isn't. Um, you're risking so many things, you know, false allegations. Uh, you know, one of your female colleagues running off to HR. You know, it um, it seems ridiculous that a woman would run off to HR just because one of her colleagues you know complimented her on a dress sense, but unfortunately. A lot of women like not not all of them. I mean, you know, you might compliment a woman on her dress sense, and she might appreciate it. But yeah, but unfortunately, a lot of um, women uh, they they don't like receiving a compliment um, if it's from the wrong person. And what I mean by the wrong person, if you're if you're not a, if you if you're not Chad, if you know what I mean. I mean, women often complain about being objectified and looked at by men, but that's only because the wrong men are objectifying and looking at them. And if, I mean, if, if, if Chad is checking him out or objectifying him, it's not a problem. But if an average or below average guy checks them out, it is a problem. Um, but, you know, women can't dictate which guy, which men are going to look at them and which guys aren't. I mean, you know, if, a guy, if a guy's going to find you attractive, he's going to check you out, regardless of whether you find him attractive or not. But, yeah, you need to be very careful out there, guys. It's, um, yeah, it's a very... Uh, we live in a very anti-male world. Now, with that said, don't, don't, you know, don't get me wrong. Obviously, you should never, you know, uh, act inappropriately towards them. You shouldn't shouldn't stalk or harass them. You should never, ever do that. Never. I mean, if a woman rejects you or knocks you back, politely thank her for a time and leave her alone. Leave it at that. You don't want to do with these stupid pickup artists. I've been watching some ridiculous PUA videos and... It's as clear as day these women are not interested in these guys. And look, to be fair, a lot of these women are pretty polite. And they're pretty patient with these guys. I mean, you know, um, you couldn't blame some of these women for telling these PUAs to, you know, F off. Because these PUAs can be very, very pushy. Very pushy. And they, you know, they're really playing with fire, these guys. So, yeah, it's, it's probably... Um, yeah, so that's basically why I've made this video. The, the suggestion of a desolate soul. And once again, I thank you for that suggestion. Um, yeah, no, I wouldn't cold approach a woman if she hasn't given you any choosing signals. Uh, not, not a good idea, really not. Um, you know, I, I look at myself and I say, oh, Master Yadi, you idiot, why, why did you approach those women? But you have to remember I'm 54 years old and when I, when I was cold approaching women, not that I cold approached too many of them, to be honest, um, you know, it was more of a dating culture back then and, I only cold approach those women on the advice from, from people from previous generations, like generations like boomers and older generations, where you could cold approach a woman and theoretically, you know, um, 
caught her in data, but as we know, as most of you guys know, that you know, the, the dating culture is dead. It's, it's pretty much hookup culture now. Um, yep. Yeah, so, you know, so basically, that's, that's, that's all. I, all I have to pretty much say. That's all I have to say on the topic. Just uh, yeah, don't don't approach women unless they give you the green light to do so, because you're you're asking for trouble. You really are. Anyway, guys, thanks for listening to my video. Um, please leave your likes, comment, and subscribe. And uh, I'll speak to you soon. You guys have a great day. Thanks. Bye for now.